Welcome back to Rush Lefort. Hello. We're still playing Undertale. Um, yeah. And actually, uh, we we've already we've already played beyond this point. Yeah. So you know how it's a half blind uh, playthrough. <laughs> well, at this point, it's like the whole blind the whole blindfold got ripped off my face, and they said they just went like, "Do it again." <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> so um, I guess I could go into a bit of a detail because I had to deal with this, but um. Basically, we have an Elgato, and we don't quite know what caused the issue. And an, an Elgato is a capture it's, card. It's a cat. We have a cat. We it, don't know the issue with it yet. <laughs> we haven't gone to the vet. But, <laughs> but um, one of the issues was there's there might have been an auto convert to MP4. And if you record at the same time as it's converting, then there's a chance that both get. And this is the point where everyone falls asleep. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm trying to say it even more excited. Like, <laughs> like, so we lost an entire day of footage. That's pretty yeah. much the gist of it. And, uh, yeah. And we haven't nailed down the exact cause of it. It's really stupid. It's very and... complicated, and we could get into the entire thing right now, but... <laughs> but that's... It's basically why I can just... I just walk through this and be like, Oh, that's definitely where the Switch was. Yeah. And, like... Because we, we played, like... I want to say like an hour maybe ahead of this. Yeah, it was definitely. I'm not gonna spoil anything because some people yeah, have no. actually complained to me. I've actually received complaints that people are like, "Could you not like talk about what happens later in the game?" Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, like, uh, well, we'll do that because people said yeah. something. So, but okay. uh, anyway, let's actually get into the game because that's another complaint. Is we don't talk yeah. about the game enough. So, uh, so Todd, uh, this, oh. this boss fight that you've never oh. never played before. Oh. This is the smell. Oh yeah, that's not gonna really work. <laughs> oh, Josh, I don't know what's gonna happen. I've never. Oh, they got they got sharp. <laughs> Everyone's just gonna call us out. But anyway, uh, oh, it makes me want to eliminate, eliminate you. Oh yeah, and we also, uh, since since this game doesn't uh, save your previous saves, it just overwrites your save every time. We had uh, to yeah. go back and replay the beginning yeah, we had, of the game. So I got extra practice. So I'm actually better at. Yeah. The dodging parts, even. So honestly, it's probably a better thing that 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 happens. Yeah. For your skills in the game. <laughs> uh, did you notice when the when the axes cross each other, they form a heart? Oh. Yeah. I never actually it's a, found it's that neat out. Touch. I don't think I noticed that before. So I made them re-sniff me. Um, I think you did that after you rolled around. Oh, oh, oh. So yeah. Got to roll around to smell like a puppy. Gotta get myself like dirt. Yeah. Puppies are. You got a puppy recently. Yeah. It's a very radio I, show like right now, but. <laughs> You got um, a puppy. Yeah, my my mom and my younger brother and sister uh, came into town for their orthodontist appointment, and they kind of surprised me because they were coming down to get a puppy. <laughs> a little pupper. A little, 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 little pupper. I like little, calling little them little puppers. Pooper. Little pooper. I like calling them puppers. <laughs> little pups. I, I like pupper. calling them poopies. <laughs> little little poops. I had a kitten that I called a, a puddin. Because <laughs> it would poop everywhere. <laughs> it wasn't really Colored like chocolate pudding. We were sort of taking care of it, so it was more or less a temporary name. Yeah. But I, I, I by potty train pooper. <laughs> Puddin, Puddin, you confused me with the, the dog talk. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, I don't know where to go past that point, but. Um, well, uh, when we went to go get the puppy, there were three puppies. Uh, there was a male and two females, and their mom was there, a little little mama dog. Yeah. And and we, we we put the put the puppy we picked out in the cage, and then and then the mom, she started like following the cage around. Oh no. And then she jumped in the car after we opened the door, planted herself in the back seat, refusing to move, and then the puppy started whimpering. And then as we drove away, the puppy was whimpering. I and think. I felt personally. like a slave trader. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know what to do at this point. They think I'm a lost puppy. Yeah, and then you pet them. Uh, I did. Oh. Oh, I have to pet the other one. I've only been okay. petting the first one. All right. I've just been like, <laughs> hey, you're a good dog, aren't you? <laughs> oh, oop. You moved in the blue. Ah. All right, I'm going to pet. Oh, no, no. I got to pet that one. Pet yeah. Oh. The oh, th one. That's, that's the one you pet last time. No, because the other one on the right was like, what about me? Oh, really? Oh, okay. Yeah, let's see. Ba ba boom. The dog's minds have been expanded. <laughs> Their eyes are like, whoa. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has been opened up for us. Oh, and another thing I noticed um, in the last time we played this boss <laughs> fight 
was that uh, each of their cloaks yeah. has a picture of the other dog oh, geez. on it. <laughs> ah, jeez. How do I solve this? Oh. This is a, this is a very difficult puzzle. Also, uh, if you've oh. noticed, um, in the whole tutorial section of the game, yeah, like, none of those puzzles have showed up again. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, I think it was... I think... We were talking about earlier when I was replaying this that the tutorial is a satire on tutorials. Oh, yeah. it, it definitely is. It goes further level, <laughs> where there's more difficult stuff that the tutorial doesn't teach you, and so yeah. that happens a lot in games. And, and it still has to teach you these concepts naturally in the game later. Like, um, like the games are supposed to be. <laughs> <laughs> so we're still... Uh, we're trying to follow the same timeline as before. Trying yeah. not to break off like Barry Allen, but... <laughs> that's going on in the show right Flash now. reference. <laughs> Flashpoint. <laughs> so, um, what should I do? I think I left it. I don't want to lie to Papyrus. I, I think he gets excited no matter what. Yeah. which one you choose. Really? Yeah. Wowee. You resisted the flavor of my home-cooked pasta. <laughs> Just so you could share it with me. Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. I want. <laughs> nye. <laughs> I like the nye at the end. <laughs> Normally you would laugh like nye, <laughs> but it's just <laughs> yeah. nye. It's like he has it all backwards. <laughs> <laughs> A sock collection. Sometimes I wonder if he would do without <laughs> such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't know if Sans could go on without Papyrus there to watch out for him. <laughs> Human! Hmm. How do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. <laughs> I never got that last time. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, I just did the puzzle of, like, straight <laughs> like, okay, blah, blah, blah. It does vaguely look like his face. It froze on the ground. Now the solution is different! And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. Now, last time Todd played this, Mm -hmm. uh, he got this puzzle literally in the first try. Yeah, so don't worry. It still is in a way... I get a lot of these early ones pretty fast, but... So it's not like, hey, but he played it before. It's not half blind through. Hey, people have either been blind or they've been playing it full-eyed. No one's done a half blind through before. <laughs> I, I like that mixing of the words there, half blind through. Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's honest, like, I don't think most people that are doing it blind were able to buy the game and avoid all spoilers. Oh yeah, no. The very beginning, maybe. Because the first people playing it. Everyone that. on the internet has spoiled things about Undertale. Yeah. Inadvertently. Let's see. Uh, I don't remember like, it. Within the first month that the game came out, people were very careful about spoilers, but then after that, it was, like, free reign, open season for spoilers. Yeah. Whew. Yeah, you got it. Got it. It's... In retrospect, it's actually kind of hard to mess this one up. Yeah. <laughs> I almost did, though. You solved it, and you did it without my help. Incredible! <laughs> I'm impressed! We also made fun of everyone uh, doing the voices of Papyrus all weird. Yeah, was that in the episodes we lost? Probably. Probably but maybe. maybe not. Yeah. Maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> it might be even too easy for you! Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I mentioned, I don't know if this was in... The last episode, or the ones we lost, but I mentioned that Ross O'Donovan from Game Grumps yeah. does, like, personally, I think, a very annoying Papyrus <laughs> voice. Well, that's sort of, like, to be uh, a little almost insultive to Ross, sort of in his nature. <laughs> to be annoying in the show. In the show, at least, you can't deny that. Yeah. <laughs> like, he, he goes out of his way to troll people a lot. Yeah, so that's maybe kind of he's trolling the command base. Maybe. But, but um, um... And ironically... <laughs> Uh, the other day, or this might date the episode a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I'm thinking it will. I wasn't going to mention it, so, too. Uh, uh, in, in... <laughs> oh, what, did you freeze? I, I, guy lost, I lost that... the words. He... A, a non-specific time ago. Oh. <laughs> uh, a non-specific time ago, <laughs> Ross we t retweeted something um, from the guy who did the Skeletor. original voice for Skeletor. Yeah. And he was reading a papyrus line. And he's like, I wish I throw the switch! <laughs> like, wow, he's lost it. <laughs> he found him in an alley. <laughs> Go, cakes! No, he actually pulled off a really good papyrus voice. Yeah, it was voice. great. Like, and nice, subdued. If they ever do a voice acting for it, he's probably the guy to do it. Honestly, I mean, he's Skeletor. He's a skeleton he's guy. He's Skeletor. He's practically a skeleton at this day and age, you know what I mean? He's pretty you old. See how old he is? You see how old he is? He'll be a skeleton soon, he's if you know what I mean. He's pretty old. <laughs> Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Oh yeah, all these rules you gotta memorize. Oh right. 
You gotta, 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 but you've played this before, so this is like a refresher on the rules. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be really good at it. That you're definitely going to need. Alarm tiles, if you step on them, you don't have to find my sir, because that's <laughs> what alarms do, you know? <laughs> Orange tiles are so wait. Since monsters are roaming around here, yeah. The or like the green tile makes a monster. So I guess they like come up and they're so, like, "You yeah, stepped on it, it, so I'm gonna fight you now." Would it summon a monster or would I, the monster I think have they to... would like sort of walk in and but fight you. But then, but then they would have to do the, the puzzle. Too. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! I stepped on another green. <laughs> and one walks in and was like. Well, so you stepped on the green. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> These are the rules. So. The monsters keep coming. They just keep stepping on green. Ah, oh, jeez. I was like, trying to get to the guy because he's on green tile and he's like. <laughs> or no, the, they get to your green tile, but since they stepped on the green tile, they summon another monster to yeah, fight them. Yeah, it's a whole Meeseeks problem. <laughs> you know, they can't be done until they fight you. But if they kill the one that's supposed to fight you, then they're like, well, well he was supposed to fight a monster, but. I'm supposed to fight him. If he fights the guy and he wins, then I can't fight him. And then the green tiles moot. 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 M O O T. M moot. Moot. Todd, you're missing all the rules. Oh, yellow tile in the water. Will You've also had your sleep. eyes off the screen for minutes. I know. I, was, <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say I'm asleep, but we were doing the commentary over it. <laughs> Which piranhas do not like? <laughs> they do not like lemon. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How, How was that? that? Understand? Understand the explanation? Yes. Thank goodness they put that I, as the first one. I, I was going to recommend saying no, because something silly happens. Oh, oh dang it. <laughs> I thought it was going to be another, uh, like, owl from Zelda thing. No, not exactly. Just to be like, oh, no. <laughs> it's entirely uh, you... random. When you say no, Papyrus will start listing off the rules again, but he'll start mixing them up and getting them <laughs> Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> I think they might have been different here, maybe. They probably I don't think weren't. so, but they might have been. He, sh I don't they, know. he should have put that in as that. That would have been great. Like, <laughs> wait, wait, the last time I played this red made me smell like lemon. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Get ready. Here and this go. is like a seizure it's randomly warning. generated, so who it's knows if it'll It's procedurally be generated. It's like No Man's Sky. <laughs> 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 wow, Toby Fox... He, he, he predicted all of this. Yeah, it's fantastic. <laughs> there's an infinite amount of solutions. It's like, because there's so many random pixels, it's like there visiting an alien world. <laughs> oh, I can't even step off it. <laughs> oh. No. Oh, I want to talk to... Whoa. Wait. What just... It, you left the screen, <laughs> came back, and oh, well. then it reset. That was very disorienting. Yeah. <laughs> hey, guy. Oh, yeah, you didn't pet him that much. This dog is staring brightly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. <laughs> That's pretty much how most people do art. The the thing with this dog that you fought earlier, if you pet him more, his head will grow taller, if you guys haven't noticed. Uh, the taller his head grows, the more effort he'll put into building these snow dogs. Oh! If you, huh. if you pet him too much, then he'll go absolutely insane with the yeah. snow dogs. He'll go everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, should I save? Um... Uh, how, how much time do we have? Well, we went over it. Okay, um, <laughs> since we don't know exactly if this episode's going to be glitched yeah. or not, uh, we're not going to save yet. We're going to probably do that in between episodes. As if they care. Oh, okay. Yeah, whatever. Okay, thank you. So yeah, we may or may not see you on the next episode. Oh man, that will be really depressing. Uh, Hopefully that you guys get to see this. Otherwise, this is going to be a very rough playthrough for the rest yeah, of this series. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.